breaking news. Michigan State Police telling us that a Matawan police officer has been involved in a shooting. We know that no officers were injured, and we know that three suspects were involved. One has been arrested. Two are still on the run. Let's get right out to the scene right now in Van Buren County. That's where we find 24-Hour News 8's Brady Gillum. Right up the road from here, and after that had happened, one of the uh, individuals that was in the vehicle was hit by gunfire. Two others fled the vehicle. All, I've been informed, are currently in custody. Um, the individual that was shot is, I'm told, stable right now, but at the hospital. And the other two are currently with police. Okay, and was the one that was shot driving the car? No, that was a passenger. Um, Can you tell us what prompted the police? Yeah, we'll let us all this. I believe it was a traffic stop that prompted the uh, the initial um, the initial contact with the individual, and then after that, things unfolded where the officer felt that um, shots needed to be fired. Why did he feel that shots needed to be fired? What I don't know. I still have to talk to the officer. We're just this just happened not too long ago, so we're still working through that. And where exactly did this happen? Right around here, obviously. Yes, about a quarter mile from where we're standing. Could you talk about, uh, and the officer wasn't injured, were they? No. And the schools right now, what's going on? The schools are on lockdown right now. We're actually getting ready to inform them that they can lift their lockdown because all of the uh, suspects are in custody. Okay, so three suspects, all in custody. Uh, do you know if they're male or female? I don't know if you mentioned One male and two females. One male and two females. Any other description of the suspects, like age or? I, I do not at this time, I no. heard this was possibly from a stolen vehicle. Can you? The, the vehicle that they were in was in fact stolen, yes. Okay. Was it Madawan that initiated the stop, or was it? It was it was Madawan Police Department that initiated the stop. We're we're here to investigate the officer-involved shooting portion of it. Okay. And was do you know if they were after this vehicle because it was stolen? Can you speak on that? Or? I, I don't know at this point. I do know that a traffic stop took place, and um, after the after the stop, it was discovered that the vehicle was stolen either before or after. Okay. And the, what time did this happen? It was right around 8 a.m. 8 a.m. And All just right. so I'm clear, is a Meta One officer who fired? Yes. Yes. I think we're good unless you have anything else. No, the only the only other thing to mention is when the investigation is is concluded, it will go to the prosecutor's office, and the prosecutor will make a decision on whether or not um, the shooting was justified or not. Okay. Very well. Thank you very much. All right. All right, there you have it. We just heard from uh, Mr. Christensen with uh, Michigan State Police. Uh, there has been an officer-involved shooting this morning here in Matawan. I am in McGillan Avenue and Main Street. Uh, he says all three suspects are in custody. Uh, before he spoke, we thought there were two suspects still on the loose. That is not the case. Uh, it was a Matawan officer this morning around 8 o'clock who fired at a suspect. That suspect is in stable condition right now. Uh, the other two suspects are in custody. Custody. Of course, we'll, uh, there's a heavy police presence here. McGillan Avenue is completely shut off. We will continue to follow the story and provide you any new updates as we get them. Reporting live in Matawan, Brady Gillum, 24 hours.